bachelor's degree in international relations and French, which I completed in 2012, and a master's degree in international development management, which I completed in 2021. I had a broad range of interests across different subjects and international relations kind of encompasses all of those subject areas. When you study international relations, it is beneficial to have a language attached to that, which is why I decided to study French alongside it. As my optional modules, I picked Spanish polylang modules. So then I had two languages which I could use as part of my course. I wanted to work in the third sector, so to work for an NGO or a charitable organisation. I am really lucky that is exactly what I ended up doing. Currently, I am back in the UK working for a government organisation. The thing I enjoy most about my job is how challenging it is. I don't like doing the same tasks day in and day out, but my job really offers a variety. No two days are the same. At the moment is the competition. The job market is so competitive right now. And on top of that, most employers like to use skills tests to make sure they have the right candidate for the role. And just preparing for those skills tests is another job. You have to be really tenacious and stay positive. Eventually, one of those doors will open. not limit yourself to the subjects that you study. For example, if you're doing a degree in politics, it doesn't mean you have to go for jobs in politics. Just look at the different skills you have that you can pull on when doing those job applications. Research skills. If I'm doing something to do with insurance, that is not something that I have previous knowledge in. So those research skills I gain at university really help me to just go away, research the topic area. I was voted student representative, so that means that those skills that I gained from that has proved really helpful in my career. I remember our lecturers always used to encourage us to think outside the box and to think creatively. They used to encourage us to look at a novel area that hadn't really been explored. And this has come in so handy. Innovation is something that is so important to all companies at this moment.